My previous YouTube video on how I learned to front wheel hop was really well received. I think primarily because I related to the frustrations of trying to learn something and not having all the prerequisite skills in place. I didn't just show you what good looks like, but rather I took you on a journey of how to get there. We all learn at different paces, and a five minute YouTube video or even a full weekend clinic sometimes makes you feel like you're drinking from a fire hydrant. It's hard to digest it all. Learning to front wheel hop is not quick and easy. There's lots of prerequisite skills that take focus, time, and effort to develop. What we need is a path to learn at our own pace, a way to assess our progress as our skills grow and keep the fires of motivation kindled by increasing challenges. That's what I want to share with you today. I've put together a digital course that is filled with detailed content all about developing all the needed skills to front wheel hop. This is a comprehensive approach, which starts with learning to balance and moves all the way through strategies to begin using hops in a section. Regardless of where you're starting from or how long you've been riding, this continuum of lessons is going to give you a path on how to progress and move forward. It includes everything you need to develop each and every prerequisite skill. You can find out more about this course at trialsprogression.com forward slash hop. Now, this course is more in depth than anything I've made on YouTube or seen anywhere else. It's going to include bite sized lessons and assessments to help you gauge your progress and keep you motivated. It has downloadable action steps and drills for you to work from. It has its own platform separate from distractions, and it's organized so you can clearly see the whole outline and progress at your own pace based on your ability to put in the time and train. But now you're going to have a coach to guide you on this well lit path. The road to learning front hops has often a landmine of questions regarding suspension. Many people will tell you, just leave the suspension alone at the factory settings. And for the most part, I agree if you're the factory rider weight of 170 pounds. The journey of learning to ride a trials bike is easier when your suspension is set up for your weight. Properly tuned suspension increases your control and comfort and your ability to turn. Now, this suspension guide that's going to come with the front wheel hops course is not just about turning knobs to be able to hop. It's about getting your bike into the proper balance for you to improve your riding, control, and traction, which when done correctly also increases your ability to perform unload moves, including hops. Now, my story of learning can also be your story of success as I share with you each of the micro skills or building blocks and how to develop them. We're going to start with static balance and learn balance corrections through rolling hops. I'm going to talk through understanding how to get momentum going backwards through rollback drills. It's important to be able to move in time with your suspension because it requires less effort. We're going to start with small hops and not work towards a pogo. We're going to focus on cutting down the turning diameter and refining techniques that you can hop both ways equally well. It's important to develop that weak side. We're also going to be talking through strategies on how to use hops in a section. If you'd like to learn more about this course, just go to the link below, trialsprogression.com forward slash hop.